Welcome back to Orchestration Minute. Today we're talking about Gustav Mahler's ability to orchestrate in a way that sounds folksy, particularly in this very klezmer-ish sort of style. Now there are a lot of different factors that go into making something sound like folk music, such as harmony, melodic motions, and articulation, but orchestration has a lot to do with it. In this particular example, in the third movement of his Symphony No. 1, the melodic content is mostly given in the woodwinds. And while that main melody is given by the clarinets and bassoons, the counterline is given in the flutes and trumpets. Now this is all accompanied by percussion with one player playing a bass drum and a cymbal. And the string section takes advantage of percussive effects like pizzicato and colenio. And so all these different factors sort of come together and the instrumentation here is sort of like an enlarged version of a klezmer band. Drop a like and subscribe if you learned something and I'll see you next week.